What's going on guys? Wanted to share a quick video. I've got Webster with me. Where is he? There he is. This is Webster's last week and Webster's done fantastic guys. He's, I think he's about 12 months, about a year old now. He came in at 11 months. So he's just coming up on his uh, birthday. And um, one of the things that Webster's owners wanted me to teach him um, is a specific command. Um, when Webster was young, Webster had a, a heart murmur and the vet found that he has a condition called ASD. It's a arteral septal defect, whatever that means. So it's um, nothing that's very serious. However, uh, Webster does have to uh, go on an annual uh, visit to the vet and be examined. And so when Webster goes to the vet, he gets real excited. It's hard for him to control his impulse and things like that. So they asked me if we could teach Webster to lay on his side and be examined. And so we've been working on it all week and we're gonna start adding a little bit of duration um, to this and even start touching him all in his ears, on his uh, body and things like that. And we're actually gonna start naming the command side. So we'll start him in a down position and then we put him on, a side, on his side and we've asked for a little duration this weekend. Um, and he's doing pretty good at that. You know, he's, he picks up things really, really easy. Um, now, with that being said, there's a relational component to this that needs to be addressed um, that you know Webster's owner and I you know, discussed uh, when Webster got dropped off. So like, for example, if Webster like goes into the vet or any public place and uh, Webster's owners allow Webster to get all excited and, and people start touching him and talking to him and things like that, um, it's, it's not gonna clean up, there's gonna be a problem. So it's very, very, very important that Webster's owners continue to reinforce Webster being calm in public, especially in places like the vet. So Webster, uh, Webster's owners are going to, you know, have to, you know, tell people, you know, when he goes to the vet and goes into the public places that, you know, he's training right now because, again, if, you know, he's a friendly dog, he doesn't have an aggressive bone in his body, he's awesome. However, he's a young dog and he gets excited and that excitement causes bad behavior. That's kind of the, the root of most behavior problems is excitement because when dogs get excited they like impulse control and you know they're more reluctant to, to listen to their owner so we've been practicing this all week we're gonna name it side or go on your side and we start Webster in a down position and we've kind of been putting him on his side um, today we're actually gonna start naming the command side and I'll give you an example um, he's been going on his side pretty good um, he's got some good duration, and then we'll start, uh, you know, touching his feet, touching his ears, and all that stuff as well. So and by the time he comes home, hopefully, when I say side, he'll just go over to the side. Right now, we're having to use touch to get him on his side. He's excited right now. Um, so I'll just kind of give you a, a, an example of what we're doing. Side. Good boy. Good, that was good. Side. Good boy. Side. Good boy. No, side. Good. Side, good. 
side. Side. No. No. Side. Good. Down. Side. Good boy. Side. Good boy. Down. Side. No. Side. Good. Side. Good boy. Good boy. Oh is a rock star. So what we'll do is we'll start adding more duration and more distraction. And that distraction meaning touching him. So, um, and by the end of this week, We'll go to actually the pet store and let somebody he doesn't know kind of examine him. I've got a great relationship with Pet Supplies Plus here in Plano. They're so awesome. Um, and so, uh, again, I'm not one to let people pet, um, you know, my client dogs in public uh, for a lot of different reasons. I'm not going to get into that. However, for this situation, um, we're going to do that. So, uh, anyways, have an awesome day. The rock star and I will check in with you soon, guys. Take care.